In this video, I'm going to show you how you can compare and swap tokens from right within MetaMask with swaps. Welcome to Everbit Helps. I hope you find today's video useful, and if you do, then please give it a like and share. Plus, for the latest information on MetaMask, please check out everbithelps.co.uk. MetaMask users can now compare and swap tokens directly within MetaMask, the world's most popular Ethereum wallet and Web3 browser. The new token swaps feature fetches quotes across multiple decentralized liquidity sources to ensure users get what they are looking for at the best available price with the lowest network fees. This feature is initially available for users of the MetaMask extension on the Firefox browser and will soon be rolled out to other browsers and MetaMask Mobile too. Up to now, MetaMask users would need to go to the website of a specific decentralized exchange or exchange aggregator, sign in, approve each token on each DEX, costing money in gas, and then run the swap. However, now MetaMask have collaborated with Consensus to build swaps, a feature that enables any Web3 or DeFi user to easily access the tokens that they need for the sites that they use. MetaMask will seek the best exchange rates for any given trade, accessing all the best known places to conduct an exchange. And this includes services such as Uniswap, Paraswap, Kyber, One Inch Exchange, and Dex.ag. This may all sound familiar, as it isn't really much different to what existing decentralized exchange aggregators like One Inch or Paraswap do. However, MetaMask has one big advantage, and that's the fact that most DeFi users were already using MetaMask to access these platforms. Therefore, this reduces the number of steps required to get access to your tokens. This new service is the latest step in monetizing MetaMask, and there's a dynamic fee that ranges from 0.3% to 0.875% based on the order size. With MetaMask swaps, they state that you'll find the best price every time by requesting prices from all available aggregators along with individual market makers, giving you access to the greatest liquidity, the largest selection of tokens, and the most competitive prices. As I mentioned earlier, there are now fewer approvals needed to perform a swap, as you no longer need to approve every token on multiple DEXs and aggregators for each trade. You simply approve each token once, helping to reduce on gas fees. And they say the swap will also determine which aggregator is the most gas efficient for every trade. They'll also help to reduce slippage impact on the final price, as when swapping in MetaMask, orders are spread across virtually every single DEX. So let's jump in and take a look over on Firefox now. And the first thing you'll wanna do is head over and open up the MetaMask extension. And you'll now see a new swap button next to buy and send. You can then select the tokens that you wanna swap. And click on to get quotes. MetaMask will then run in the background. And you can compare all available quotes and select the best one. Then finally, just click on to swap and wait until the transaction completes. If you already have MetaMask, but it's installed over on Brave or Chrome, and you still want to take advantage of the swap feature, you could always install MetaMask onto Firefox and import your existing MetaMask account, which I'll show you how to do now. So if you head across to metamask.io, download and install MetaMask for Firefox and tick both boxes, we can then go ahead and open up the MetaMask app where you'll be prompted to get started. And instead of creating a new wallet, we're going to be importing one here. 
Then we simply need to enter in our 12 word phrase for our other MetaMask account. And we put that into this section, which you can paste from a clipboard, or enter in each word with a space to separate them. You'll need to create a password and confirm it, and agree to the terms of use. Then finally, import. And as you can see, that was all pretty easy, and you can now start swapping. And if you're interested in finding out more about MetaMask, then I'll pop a link to a full tutorial in the summary below. So that's how you can now compare and swap tokens from right within MetaMask. And I hope that you enjoyed this video today. And if you did, then please give me a like, hit the subscribe button, and please do head over to my website at everybithelps.co.uk for more tips, reviews, and step by step guides. Thanks, and I'll see you soon.